This is a really good price for filet mignon. The whole tenderloin is $40. Not a bad price for baby bag ribs. $8.98. I take that. It's made in Arizona. Sock it to me. I'm getting it. Gosh, y'all. Have y'all ever seen a Brussels sprout the size of your hand? Chicken on there, girl. If you don't throw that chicken on there, just say ksh. What's up, Fire Squad? Babe, where are we at? Today, 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 y'all, we bringing y'all somewhere different. This is called the Butcher and Farmer Market. Yes, here in Buckeye. We're going to find out what they have, the meats and stuff, and shop local, y'all. Yes, and see if we can get some fresh butchered meat here. Here is the place. Butcher Market. Yeah. Yes, indeed. This looked like a little small town out here, huh? It is a small town. <laughs> Let's get a basket. Get the wipes. Ooh, they have our C4s up in here. Yes, we're going to grab it. Twisted limeade. That sounds really good. What's the purple? The purple one is purple frost. You want to try it? Yeah. All right, here you go. And then what's this mango? I've never seen drinks like this. Look, parrot, mango. Ooh, and it's with the pop, y'all. So Leah might like that. Yeah, let's get this for Leah. They got two for five up in here on their uh, chips, babe. Weekly ad. That's cool. What do you see? They have their own seasoning? Yes. Ranch dip mix, lemon dill. Creamy dill, Ooh. salsa, garlic, French onion, beau monde. Oh, so how would we use this? Do we? This is a dip mix. I wonder if this is like a seafood mix. It doesn't say the use for it. Yeah, they do. They say two tablespoons of this mix with sour cream. So these are like, this is pretty much for chips, babe. That's these are cool. different chips. What do they have? I'm gonna get these. Oh yeah, that looks delicious. That's like the Mexican chips, right? Burn or tortilla chips. We'll try that. Low sodium, sea salt, gluten-free. Cool, we'll try them. All right, here is their meat. They have the shrimp here, medium. They got the wild Mexican medium shrimp, cool. The large ones, jumbo Mexican shrimp. Got the head on, cool, cool, cool. Oh, they had the pollo asada. Oh, this is so good. Pollo asada was off the chain. Look at that. And what is in here? Oh, they have the scallops in this container, $4. You get a bunch of them too, y'all. Look at that. Then they have chorizo, $3.76. That is a good price. I think we're gonna grab that for breakfast tomorrow. We're gonna grab that. That'll be for breakfast. We just need tortillas. I'll try their brand of chorizo homemade. They have their own sweet Italian, $2.90. These, the ribs that they butcher. This is $16. Oh, you get two. Oh, these are the big, the beef ones, the big boys. Look at that. Oh, they have ground sirloin, $15 that they do in-house. This is a really good price for filet mignon. The whole tenderloin is $40. And then you cut this up, make filet mignon steaks. And they do have their in-house ground pork, ground chuck beef, $16.82 for, so it's almost $5 a pound. Dang. Y'all, comment down below. Have you ever heard of butter steaks, babe? You heard butter of butter steaks? steaks? Oh. Butter like steaks, $12.86. Melt in your mouth. We should just get that to try it. And they, and they have prime meat too, look. Yep. That is prime, that's a roast, babe. Y'all, look at the font. That is so cool. They keeping their hood up in here. <laughs> this one, this is $10, that's even cheaper. What's that one? Beef pork. Beef, and, so it's beef and pork hamburger patties. Now that is different. So our ground beef is made 15 feet away, not 15, not 1,500 miles away. Hey, they got breakfast steak, their sirloin, and, and then this is carne picada with spices and vegetables. That's eleven sixty two. What are you making, babe? With um, hibachi. Oh, um, you're making hibachi. This will be good. Yeah. So this is the prime Angus stir fry, and that's four thirty three. We can get that for the hibachi. Yeah. Yeah. That's a that's cheap for prime steak. Only five sixty six. Look, it's from the short ribs. That's something different. Boneless. There's a little one for Aaliyah. Let's see, y'all. Uh, yeah, this one's only three dollars. Look at this. Yeah, that's prime good. prime eye round steak for three dollars. Yeah. She'll for, make this for the boys. Yeah, that'll be for the dinner. She liked to cook, y'all. Girl, why are you making that face? <laughs> Look at you. That's bacon wrap. Ooh, fillet bacon wrap. Fifteen twenty-eight. Sweet breads beef. 
Honestly, y'all, I think that's brain, right? Comment down below. Is sweetbread's brain from a cow? I think it is. Or is it? I don't think it's brain. This is an oxtail, y'all. This is a, what is that? 127 per pound. So that one's 16. Neck bones. Neck bones. That's 390. What we got here? Bones, knuckle, knuckle beef. You got the knuckles. That's a dollar twenty. That's not a bad price for baby bag ribs. Eight ninety eight. I take that. This one's only seven, babe. Their ribs are a good price, so I'm gonna get a couple. Seven dollars, and it's baby back, the tender one. Yeah, I'm gonna get two. This is a bigger one, nine. And their chicken's already cut up for the little hibachi. That's two oh four. Oh, chicken heart. They have a whole turkey breast, four fifty nine. Look at that. That's a huge. Look, I am strictly fresh. I like this place. How is this only one ninety six? If you're single, you look at that. Dollar ninety six. That's that's a good price, huh? Yeah, get that, babe. Look, premium Canadian bacon, and you love Canadian bacon. Look at there you go. There you go. Y'all, I have never seen a crushed soda cake. Oh my goodness, look at that. That is cool. So this is local here in Arizona, this brand Cafe Valley, and they make a lot of cakes. They even have, I th they have the pies too, but this one is called Jesse's. Let me see if this is Arizona. No, this is California, so cool. Oh, made locally, look at that. Lemon ice loaf cake. I'm gonna get this from my mom. She would like it. It's five dollars almost, four fifty. But I think my mom would love that, so I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get this from my mom because she loves lemon loaf, and then maybe you and her can. And it's Arizona. It's local. So, are these Arizona brand too? Arizona? No, nah, this is Texas. Made here. It's made in Arizona. Sock it to me. I'm getting it. Arizona made here, local. We got something cool over here too. Is that salsa in a pack? That's different. Let, let's just try it because it's different, man. They, even got they got habanero. Super hot salsa. Ooh. We, have we tried this brand of beans? Don? Donut? Donut? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, let's get the salsa for sure. This is made in Phoenix, by the way. Ooh. Here in Arizona. Yeah, I'm definitely going to try it. Oh, we have some Arizona made tortillas. Let's get us a pack here. Look at this. Nice. We're going to get this Sonoran. This one's made, yeah, here in Arizona, but it's Sonora brand that part of Mexico. What is this? Jimmy Dean pork links. They make their own links here, y'all. Look at this. Bacon in pieces for breakfast. Look at $1.91. Uh, oh yeah, that's cheap. And, and th these have casings on it. Oh, so it's actually, this is made here in the butcher shop. Yeah. Look at this, y'all. Huge block of cheese they do here in-house too at the butcher shop. Goodness. This one's $23 for this half one. This one's 47 for this one. Huge. Kendrick wants one of these, Lordy. The oatmeal pot. Okay, Kendrick wants oatmeal. Both of y'all's, it was both of y'all's. It was everybody's. This is all Arizona grown. Got all these nice apples. Got all the vegetables, beans, pinto beans. Girl, get your hand out the beans, silly. Are these big? Are, are these the biggest Brussels sprouts you ever seen in your life or not? Oh Look how they're big huge. these Brussels sprouts are. They're huge and it's only one night now. Oh my gosh, y'all. Have y'all ever seen a Brussels sprout the size of your hand? Oh my goodness. We got fresh collard greens, broccoli. Nana has to come here. We got to bring Nana here. This is like a farmer's market. It is a farmer's market. Butcher, farmer's market. You want to get some carrots? Cool. Let's go ahead and pull that. All right, this is the fresh vegetables, y'all. Have cucumbers, bell peppers. The bell peppers are two for a dollar. They have some hatch green chili. Ooh, 149 a pound. Look at these goodies. Serrano peppers, they're delicious. Yellow chili peppers, dollar a pound. Look at the habaneros, 599 a pound. Oh my goodness. Look at this, y'all. My goodness. Like, I'm amazed because this is my first time at this farmer's market and it is lit. They got kimchi over here. That's 599. Pineapple. A dollar each for half of a pineapple? That's a good price. What is quince? Yo, what is this? Quince? How do you say that? That's different. Oh, they got papaya for a dollar a pound. Then they have this cut of watermelon. That's only 69 cents. You want watermelon? Yeah. All right, let's go ahead. Give it to mommy. She wants that. Oh, look at a multivitamin drink. You know what? Uh, 
Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's apple, pineapple. Oh, you're allergic to pineapple. You cannot have it, babe. Look. Dirt. Huh? I'm. I'm getting that steakhouse marinade. They have ancho chili. Look at this, Kentucky bourbon barbecue. Low and slow barbecue rub. Oh, I like this Texas style barbecue season. That looks good too. But they even have everything bagel. Look at this, $5.99 to dill, the plus the everything bagel, red pepper, fajita seasoning, adobo. I love adobo seasoning, $3.99. Beer can chicken rub, <laughs> $5.99, cool. I'm gonna get this one instead, Texas yeah. style, yeah. Go ahead and get your adobo, babe. You pretty much buy every brand, so try their brand. Okay. Local. Support your local business. Yeah. K Money was talking, and K Money came up with a perfect point about mm -hmm. why butcher shops and farmers markets meat are cheaper, cheaper than most stores. And you said that something about it going bad faster? Yes, yeah, so they don't have like the preservatives or whatever the case may be, it's not in the meat. So here they butcher stuff fresh. So the prices are super cheap because they got to get it out, they got to sell it. Mm -hmm. But then you, we both noticed that it's been compensated by the prices of other products. Products. They being, raise the price on normal. Exactly. Yeah. So that's how they do it. So we just wanted to make that quick note and say that. Hibachi tonight. So far, we have these egg rolls, and we got these from Kroger, y'all. So this is going with that. As well, we have these cream cheese wontons. And we bought some duck sauce. Y'all, you know it's so hard to find duck sauce. Duck sauce in the store. Right, I said Trace, duck sauce. And then we got some of this peanut sauce to go with it. It's gonna be lit. Are you are you excited, babe, to make this meal? I uh, am. Yeah. You excited? Yeah. Alright, Elliot family. It's seven. Look at you, fancy. Watch you out. Ooh. Now, careful, the griddle is hot. How hot is it? Can I touch it or no? no. Are you kidding me? No. It's uh 350. Oh. 400. That's it? All right, so let's get to the, let's get to the ingredients. Okay. We got some chicken breast. Yeah, we just got this from the hall. Yes. Yeah, the butcher hall. The meat, I got some eggs. I don't know if I'm gonna use this, but I got it out. Okay. I cut up the zucchini and the yellow squash. I got my lemon, cause you know they be squeezing it on there. Mm -hmm. The mushrooms, the onions. The onions? The rice and some seasoning and soy sauce. So you are professional today. I'm ready. You're trying to say you, you got this. Yes. Okay, let's see. Let's see if you've been to the Hibachi Grill enough. Y'all, comment down below. Have you been to the Hibachi Grill and how was your experience? Did you like it? Like was it lit? It was, was it scary with that fire? Oh, I don't got no fire tricks for y'all. Yeah, you're going to do some fire tricks. I don't got none for you. You, you ain't going to do no fire tricks, none baby? None to offer. Oh, come on. Come on. That's what they want to see. Woo. That chicken on there, girl. If you don't throw that chicken on there and just say, and let it go everywhere. I'm just playing. I don't know about this piece. You don't know about that piece? No. Not today? I wanted to cut this down a little bit more. So uh -huh. I like to see no white on there like that. Like, right. Like, what is it called? Tendle? Yeah, it's all right. Let the white stay on there. Don't cut it. I don't know about that. <laughs> she got another pack. She can't prepare it, y'all. She ain't playing with y'all today. Getting it laid out. Yes. All right. She putting some lemon on there, y'all. Who does she think she is? This Miss is Fancy? You is fancy, huh? You is fancy, huh? They did make it rain. Nails done, hair did, every... Oh, nails. I don't know nails done. <laughs> Can I get a little rain? This is going to cook fast because it's already cut up. But you like to overcook your chicken, so I don't know. I like to make sure it's done. Oh, okay. Season it with some black pepper. Okay. Garlic. Oh, yeah. Onion powder. But you already got onions, babe. Oh, that's what I need, so I'm here with it. Yeah, oh yeah, the onions, yeah. There we go. Of course, I can't cook the dish without this. Oh my God. Y'all, uh -uh. her and season salt. I'm going to do it light. I'm keeping it light. That's not light. You went over it 10 times. I'm going to keep it light. Y'all, comment down below. Anybody who's been subscribed, doesn't K-Money use season salt all the time? I do, for everything. For no matter the cuisine. Y'all thought I was playing. Look at this. Crazy. And if you're new here... Now you know, K Money here uses seasoning salt on everything. everything. Oh my goodness. Really quick, y'all. The reason why you should subscribe is because we come with that fire content every, every single day. day. You're going to have amazing videos like this and nice shopping hauls included. 
Back to the video. Taking that chicken off, it is cooked, but not burnt. I am, I'm so proud of you. No, you didn't. <laughs> I don't want no, what is this, salmonella and all oh, this? Oh, Lord. Thing. Really quick, y'all, remember this lo lemon loaf we got from the farmer's market? It's amazing, Arizona it's made, good. Kathy Valley, it is phenomenal. <laughs> Nana who? Sorry, Nana. Um, <laughs> putting some butter on there. What you about to put on there now? Yeah. Using the best, you gonna cook the vegetables now? Yeah. Cool. Yes. Getting them veggies on. Okay, money. Just throw it on there, girl. Ooh. And a ooh. Butter's burning. Butter burning. Oh, you know what we didn't put on here? Huh? Garlic. What do you mean garlic? You know how they put like fresh garlic, but it's okay. We got we got the powdered garlic. It's cool. We got fresh garlic. Yeah. Putting a little bit of garlic on there. Go, yeah. girl. She did get the garlic out, y'all. I gave her the advice. <clears throat> uh, <laughs> Okay. Salt, pepper. Salt, pepper, and butter. Yep. Right. All right, so A train took over. She wanted, she wanted uh, the chef to, uh, you know. Uh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I said you could take over the veggies. You That's gonna, nice of you, babe. That's you gonna add nice. the mushrooms in there? there? Ain't no room for no mushrooms. You better make it rain with the mushrooms. Well, I can make it rain now. You, hey, don't. <laughs> I, I can make it work, baby. Watch this. I'm gonna make it do what it do. I'm gonna make it do what it do. Right. Well, you're gonna have room to flip them things. No, 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 no. See? So I'm not gonna make it do what it do. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Is that enough butter? Yeah. Put yeah. some pink Himalayan salt, some black pepper, they need some and more salt. butter. Yeah, probably need some more salt on there. <laughs> they really do. All right, you got the rice on. About to make some fried rice. K Money said turn it down. Nope. High heat. Let's get it done. All right, so he's adding more rice. Now, the recipe says it's, hey, watch out, Kendrick. Oh, no. The recipe says it's best if you use rice that's already done. They don't suggest that you cook the rice and then start to do the hibachi. So, you might want to stir that. Stir what? That rice, it looked like it might be burning. Hey, am I cooking or? Okay, okay, thank you. we'll let you do it. Okay, thank you, thank you. Hmm. This is what we go through, y'all. Yes. She tries to make me do everything. What? Her way. No. But, <laughs> all right, this needs to flip, I know that. Oh, I'm worried about that rice, y'all. <laughs> Here she go messing with me, y'all. Please tell her to leave me alone. Oh, Lord. I shouldn't have put this. it all over there. But that's how you're supposed to do it. I, I, you know what? It's going to come out good. I'm going to have. I'm gonna be positive. There we go. Say what's up, Fire Squad. Alright. So he's starting to season. So far you use some Himalayan salt. Yep. Black pepper. pepper. A little bit of garlic. And then a little bit of soy sauce. These carrots, I know they're supposed to be the tiny mirepoix type of carrots, but the ones that are the mirepoix come with peas, and I am highly allergic to peas, so we I had to substitute, make it do what it do with the bigger size carrots. And y'all, we just mixed it. This is how the mushroom, zucchini, yellow squash, and the chicken is looking so far. We put it all up in here. Don't that look good? I just ate, y'all. Uh, Ooh. Like that one restaurant. Yeah. Better than that. Ooh. One more, son. You can have one more. I want to do yeah. it. Be careful, son, because this is all hot. <laughs> Come on. Don't put no shell in there, boy. Well, I know how to do this. Okay. Come so. on. Show me. Go ahead, Dave. Oh. Good job, son. High elbow. High elbow. There you go. High elbow. All right, go ahead and get that. And that's how how it cook. No, baby, this is too hot. Oh, Kendrick, say what's up. Say what's up, fire squad. Good job, fire squad. Y'all, those carrots gonna have to cook for a little while. Yeah. yeah we'll, we'll toss them in there.
Now it's time for the taste test. We're gonna find out how it came out. And Cash, Sean, you gonna try it too? You're gonna be the taste testers. I'm All right, go ahead. You can try it. <laughs> good the rice is good how about the chicken and the vegetables here's a fork for you Sean. <laughs> okay thumbs up nice man so sean now it's your your turn to tell us how you think it tastes oh yeah that's the cream cheese one time that's just extras just some extras for you guys. Cool. How does it taste so far, Sean? Good. Cash is gonna try the egg roll. This is a healthier meal, y'all. So I'm glad you guys are enjoying it. You got your vegetables, you got your protein. This is good. Say you all stay blessed. Peace. <laughs> Popping up on the screen, y'all, is another video being suggested. Click it, enjoy.